Good evening. Thank you for joining us. We begin tonight in Madison County, where a Madison County school employee is accused of several sex crimes involving a student. WFF 48's Daquan Lee joins us live from the Madison County School District office. And Daquan, the details of this story, they're extremely disturbing. Yeah, Nolan, they are. Madison County Sheriff deputies say they made a routine traffic stop just before midnight last night on Highway 72 and Shield Road. Inside the vehicle, they say they found a 26-year-old Madison County Schools employee and a 15-year-old student. Deputies say they arrested the driver, 26-year-old Michaela Anderton, after questioning her about the situation. But she's charged with several sex crimes, including statutory rape, sodomy, and distributing obscene material to a student. She posted bond and was released around 4.30 this afternoon. The sheriff's office says investigators worked and found the alleged sex abuse had been going on for two months. They claim Anderton began the conversations with the student and it eventually escalated to them exchanging several pictures, videos and explicit text messages back and forth. They also believe the two met up several times engaging in several sexual acts. When we reached out to the Madison County School System, a spokesperson confirms Anderton was an employee with the district at the time of her arrest, but has since been fired. In a statement, they tell us, quote, the person in question was hired earlier this month following a background check conducted by the Alabama State Department of Education. Our search history of Alabama court records revealed she had no criminal history. Now, we also asked the district spokesperson about their role and where specifically she worked. However, we were told in an effort to protect the identity of the victim, they are withholding that information. Reporting live in Madison County, Daquan Lee, 48, on your side.